look at Marquez from the third row of the grid. He's going to go into turn one in third, possibly fourth. A fantastic start. Bradley Smith leads away from Nico Troll. Mark Marquez has made an amazing start. He was lucky for Tomoyoshi Koyama not able to start the race. There was a gap. He's taken full advantage. Here we go. He's putting pressure on Mark Marquez now on Bradley Smith. Smith trying to hold him up as for long as he can. Nico Troll, his teammate, leads the way. Side by side, they come down. Look at the look at the speed difference. There is nothing Bradley Smith can do. He tries to get a toe. Can he try and retake him? No, he can't. Down into turn one. Marquez has made a remarkable start. Marquez is really getting away from him at the moment. They go through the very fast right-hand kick. And that means the rain is out. Good news is for Mark Marquez, if the race is stopped now, he will start from the front row of the grid in second position. Marquez attacks coming down the straight. He almost he looked like he pulled his arm out as if he was whipping it like a horse then, didn't he? He wants a little bit extra power down the straight, but he can't get through on Tyrol this time. Yes, and red flag's out. Red flag uh, is out. Tyrol, Marquez, Smith, Espargo, that's how they line up on the grid. We'll get an announcement in a few minutes of how many laps there will be in the second part of this race. They don't quite know it yet, but the red flag is out there. There's still rain out there. You can yeah. see it. There's my sock again. There is still rain. I, I mean, it's so localised at this track as well. You can pass. You can see rain falling still. Marcus is going fairly quick around the track to see just how much. Can push oh, it down. Gone. He's gone now. This could be massive in the championship. That's huge. And he's broken the front fairing. Can he get the bike back out there? We said he's pushing to see how much he can do it. And this, as you say, Nick, could be when a championship gets decided. He's got to go. He's got 20 seconds. They're right at that end of pit lane, aren't they, Ian? Yeah, they're almost on the guy with the board. He's actually showing a one-minute board at the moment. It's close. It's close. It's close oh. And he's still in here. He's still in now. A it's massive, close. massive moment as far as the 125cc World Championship goes. We've talked about the team remaining uh, calm, always around it, but now there is panic there. Marquez waits for the lights to go from red to green. He will start from the back of the grid, but it's only 17 riders. Nine laps of the Esteril circuit. Could it determine the outcome of the championship? It looks like someone stalled on the third or fourth row back look, there. Look at Marquez. Marquez has made a cracking start from uh, the back of the grid and already round the outside he goes through. He knows he has to make a good start. Whoa. And he's almost past Espargo already from 17th to 4th or 5th just behind Jonas Folger. What a start from Mark Marquez. Absolutely brilliant from the championship leader. He's probably going to try and do everything he can to keep Marquez at bay. Marquez is already through on Jonas Folger now on Paul Espargo. Marquez is already up into third position. Here he comes on the... Parabolica, Bradley Smith's going to hold it in there and he needs to attack back to help his teammate as quickly as possible. That's what he needs to be thinking just to be aggressive with Mark Marquez. Here he comes, Bradley Smith, on the inside of Mark Marquez. So P2 isn't going to be okay at the moment because it's P3 for Mark Marquez. Here comes Marquez again into the interior Parabolica. He'll let Marquez dive for the inside line. Now is there any way back? for Bradley Smith. Can he attack once more going up to the chicane? He's done a really good job at the moment. Will Mark Marquez attack Nico Tirol now? One lap to go. The most important lap in the 17-year-old's life. Mark Marquez, sure he's oh, he go. is. Here he goes, up the inside of Nico Tirol. Marquez leads the way. Here it comes into the interior. Parabolica, Nico Tirol is back in the lead, but on exit, Mark Marquez will reclaim it. Mark Marquez wins here in Portugal. Absolutely brilliant for Mark Marquez. Akiayo and Emilio Alfamora embrace. They know they've just taken a huge step towards the World Championship.